Horizon Hack Client is updated to Minecraft Bedrock Edition 1.20.50 and 1.20.51 so i'm going to show you exactly how you can get this for yourself and also how to use it inside of minecraft so you want to head over to their official website horizon.download as you can see right over here this is going to be linked down in the description together actually with my discord server and i'd greatly appreciate it if you could join that anyways here you want to click on this green download button where you will automatically download the horizon launcher so as you can see my downloads, I have the Horizon Injector. Now if you actually already had this on your device, then you won't really need to download it again because it just automatically downloads the latest version of the DLL available, which is great. So we can open it up here and as you can see there's no install process whatsoever, it just automatically opens this up over here. As you can see our game version is 1.20.50 which is perfect. So we can click on inject over here. Now if you want to learn how you can use this for older versions, for example 1.20.40, well then I will actually leave a tutorial for that down in the description below. Alright, great, we've injected it into Minecraft, so now I'll briefly show you how you can actually use this in just a random world here. Also, before we get further in, I'd greatly appreciate it if you could subscribe. As I said briefly, if you want the full in-depth tutorial on how to use Ryan, well then I'll leave that tutorial down in the description for you below, and you should, you're gonna find it there. I'm Right now, I'm just going to briefly show you how to use it so you can get started for yourself. Because trust me, it is actually pretty simple. So to open up the menu, you want to standard click on the insert button. But for me, that doesn't actually work because I have rebound it. To do that, you can open up in the chat and then type dot bind, just like so. Then click GUI. And then the key that you want to bind it to. Personally, I always use F. Then I can hit enter, and as you can see, Ryan says that the key binding of click GUI is now F. So once you've done that, you can open and close the menu by pressing on the button F, as you can see, which is great. You can alternatively also close it by pressing on escape. Now, this base, this right here is basically a list of all the mods, as you can see, ordered in specific different categories. To turn them on, you can click on them like so, and to turn them off, you can click on them once again as you can see now I believe standard that the HUD and the array list are actually going to be enabled which as you can see will show up on my screen over here if you want to disable those it's really simple just go into the GUI into um, the hack menu over here and then under GUI just disable those it's pretty simple now as you can see some of these utilities actually also have a plus symbol there if they do then you can right click on them and it'll expand a little area where you can customize these to your like or possibly to bypass different systems as you can see that's exactly how that works and now there is a second elephant in the room the commands of course and sadly these still do only work for local or private worlds these do not work for realms or servers if you do want a list of the commands, however, you can type dot help in chat, and this will give you a full list. Anyways, basically, that is how to use and download and install Horizon Hack Client. Thank you ever so much for watching, and I do hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.